everyone, I am Norse Scorpio, accompanied with Spyro and a heap of treasure. We're going to the sunny beaches. Where the bastards have... <laughs> They've encased our little turtle younglings in boxes. Though some of them have gotten out. Uh, let's turn on voice and see if I can, uh, if it'll work. If it won't, I'll turn it off. Simple as that. Oh yeah, I forgot about, like, one of the best features in Spyro Ripto's Rage. There's flags next to all of the beginning and exit guys. You can burn those flags away. Isn't that awesome? Hi, Spyro. It's a good thing you're here. If you can help shepherd those baby turtles over there to safety, I'll be mighty grateful. Well, it worked that time. So if I flame the turtle, he'll go and walk on this handily placed lever thing and just let us go. Those baby turtles are on their way. This is a level that you actually, well, you can't get to it until you learn how to swim anyways, but if you could, you wouldn't be able to do anything until you, uh, until you got the swim because most of it is underwater. Which is a bit of a peeve, but whatever. Come on, out the water. This turtle... Turtles, that's um, the thing about turtles. They tend to herd towards the grassy areas, but if you flame them, they'll walk away. But if you don't flame them enough, they will wander back to the nearest grassy patch, which can be a grassy pain in the ass. I think I was trying to be clever there. It didn't really work. Eh. And also, like I said, there's an area in here that you can't fucking get to until you know how to climb. So I'm not going to be able to 100% this world yet. Try and um, ambush me, you brick. I like this guy. Two hits to take him out because he's wearing a rubber floaty. Of course. That only makes sense, right? Floaties take a hit. And you see these boxes strewn all over the place. There's a power-up you get later that allows you to, um, to open those. Yeah. Gems up there I can't get to. Actually, I think I can still get to them because I have the power. No, 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 no. Get the fuck over there. Yeah. Though it's a really difficult jump, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure I can do it. It's fucking hard to do. No. You stay away. Holy crap, that almost cost me my life. Oh, there's also this fucking door here that you actually have to stand on and then you go whoop, pow. Because when I get 11, I get the super flame, the super flame. It's an awesome power. Let's talk to him. The water workers have boxed up most of our baby turtles. The boxes are incredibly strong. With a more powerful flame breath, maybe you could break them open and release the turtles. This is one of the most frustrating challenges. And you're going to hear me say that a lot. But this one, this, this level has three intensely frustrating challenges. This one, because some of the boxes are so far away that they're just stupidly hard to get to in time before your fire power-up runs away. Or runs out, runs away. Come back here! And the other one is up just over yonder. Which I actually can't get to yet because I don't have the climb. But when I get that, 
fuck. It's a duck who rings his little bell, his little fucking bell. <laughs> Whoops. Ow, you prick. Uh-oh. He rings this little bell and summons the uh, baby turtles in the area to jump into the pot because these turtles are that dense that they just go right for it, you know. Turtles be like that. Come on, flame them. Turtles be like that. There's a chef at the top of this ladder who wants to make soup out of our baby turtles. Yep. If you know how to climb, you could get up there and stop him. Yup. Which means that I got lots of work to do once I learn how to climb. I gotta come back to Glimmer. I gotta come back here. I gotta come back to Avalar in general. I can't actually... Did I miss something down here? I think I thought I did. I gotta, I gotta flame him like five times to get him up the ramp. Come on, turtle. Move your ass. I was gonna say, what's he doing? Is he gonna try and come down the ramp? There's a patch of grass like two feet from him. Thank you, young dragon. The no, baby no problem, King. From it. Please take this talisman as a token of our gratitude. Yay, the sunny beach talisman, which has been a, a, a turtle made into a plaque, you know. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, all right, let's try and do this orb challenge. Oh, fucking, fucking. Oop, bit of. Boom. Yeah, there's only seven boxes, but three of them are in annoying places to try and get to. I will agree that some of them are fairly easy to get to, though. Some of them are extremely easy to get to. Whoops, fuck, I'm not gonna get to that one that I need to. This one, on the other hand, is a pain in the ass. Though I made it look extremely easy there, didn't I? Bet I did. Well, I missed both things that I was trying to hit. Fuck. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna go back this way again. Fuck that turtle. Hop up here. Shoot that. Shoot that. Shoot the treasure. Shoot the treasure chest. Get a lot of beautiful treasures. And we're not going to be able to get 400 of 400, so I probably won't even bother trying to get up there, because I can just do it when I get actually can get there. <laughs> this is the pain in the ass one. So you got to climb these stairs, and then you got to do this, and this, and then through here, down, down, and then back up, and then down, and oh look at that, Impressive. that was not that easy, or er, not that difficult that time, and the uh, sound fucked up. Impressive, most impressive, please take this sacred herb thingamajig as a token of our everlasting gratitude. You'd think you'd have come up with a name for it if you called it sacred. Ah, fuck it. I want to see if I can make it. And if not, I'm only going to do this once. Yeah, I can't make it. I, th I swear I could do it, though. I swear. I swear it! Alright. Off to the off to the land of the Huracos now. Which is another uh, super charge world, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Where did all these baby turtles come from, is what I'm wondering. 
<laughs> oh, it's so cute. Oh, we're getting so much treasure. Maybe, um, because you didn't see, because you didn't see, do you see? After you buy the uh, swimming thing, there's also, um, Mr. Money Fucker, Mr. Money Pegs. You know what? Let's not do Huracost. Let's go over here and do the Ocean Speedway. Um, there's a wall up to another world. Oh, it's right over here. And he's not there anymore because I already paid him off. But he lowers that wall for 500 gold or something. Or not five. It can't be 500 treasure. Um, for, for a couple hundred treasure. So I had a very reduced amount at the start of this recording. If you did not notice. Which you probably didn't. Especially if you don't watch. <laughs> Here's where the mystery begins. I don't remember what is the proper order to take these in. As with the last, uh, the last Spyro thingermajigger. Shit, shit, shit. Whoa, fuck. Okay probably not gonna beat this as with the last Spyro thingy the flight worlds in Spyro um, there's four different things that you have to collect all of them give you a specific amount of time And if you collect them all, you get the full bonus and shit. But what's really cool is I get supercharge on this one instead of just the super flight. So yeah, that's something to be, to revel in. Yeah, did it? I didn't think I was going to. So yeah, you get 80 for each one now. Press X to continue. And then, we go back, we retry. Nope, oh, okay, we don't retry. <laughs> I'm gonna go back in, because in all of the speedways, there's an extra challenge afterward. Well, you don't have to do it afterwards, but it's easier to do it once you've got the, uh, the other thing out of the way. I just go in here, and I talk to one of the people watching, or one of the people in the, there's usually, at, there's well there's usually there is at least one person in every level and over here you talk to her and she gives you a speedway I challenge you think I'm pretty good well let's see if you're as good as the current champion and the current champion is hunter all right meet the course champion in order to win the race you must fly through all the rings. Beware, if Hunter flies through a ring first, the ring will start to shrink. He flies through every ring first, if I'm not mistaken. But, this is not a very difficult challenge. As long as you remember what order he goes in. Because if you go in the wrong order... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I just lost. Just like that, if you fuck up and go the wrong way, or predict that he's gonna go away and you go the wrong way, you're just done because he flies through the rings in a specific order. And that's essentially like you're following him for that reason. I mean, you can kind of get ahead of him, but you don't want to because if he goes the way that you're not predicting, you're fucked. But it's not too hard. I I love how he straps on a pair of wings in order to do this. It's just so amusing. There we go. I don't know why I was so worried there. Ugh. Ugh. Stupid. Oop. 
Whoopfa! Oh, yes, I got it. Surprising. Yeah, I don't think these ring challenges are too hard, as long as you make sure you stay behind him. And at first, like, there was some wonky turns there that sprung out at me, and I almost didn't make them and shit. I didn't make it the first time, but... It's not too bad. It's a pretty easy it's orb to get. That... They, they, they tend to get more difficult. <laughs> but what doesn't? If a video game didn't get more difficult as you played it, how boring would that fucking be? Am I retrying? Okay, I'm going home. Good. And with that, I've beaten two levels this time around, and I will see you all. We'll do Huracos next time, and possibly that area over there, which I'm... The name eludes me. Aquaria Towers. We'll, we, um, that would probably... Fuck. Yeah, that'll be the last two levels. So we'll do those, and then after that, we'll be consulting, consulting? <laughs> we'll be confronting uh, Ripto's first boss, which I think is Gulp, the big brute. But I think he, maybe he might be World 2, and the, uh, the idiot is World... Wow, they were both idiots. Even Ripto's a little bit dense. <laughs> right, anyways, I will see you all later.